Hey guys, welcome to the homestead where we live, learn, and create all on our one acre property out in the country. Today I've got Elijah out here and he just wheeled over our pressure washer. We are going to start cleaning up the beefing dump truck. Stay tuned. So we have an electric pressure washer that I got from Lowe's last year. I really, really like that thing. It's very convenient, just as a plug and play washer. And I've actually used it to do a couple of homes, driveways and stuff like that. I got no complaints. So we're up here tracing the water hose that goes to our garden, trying to find the connection because we need to supply water to the pressure washer. Should be close. Here it is. So this is a Greenworks brand pressure washer. And I'll leave a link in the description below to the exact model we have. In case you guys are interested and want to read more about it. I always like to run the water through this thing for a while to get all the air bubbles out before I turn on the pump. Otherwise it's going to want to start pressurizing and compressing the air. And I don't think that's very good for pressure washers. So it sounds like it's pretty good. So now the joy of an electric one is we just turn the switch. And that's it, ready to rock and roll. Yep. Now one other thing I wanna do is I've got some of this multi-purpose pressure washer concentrate soap. I'm gonna put it in the little soap jug down here and that's how we'll get the soapy wash to wash off all this junk off this truck. Yep, like a moss. Mm -hmm. All right, so I'm just gonna wash this off with water for right now, and then I'll start soaking it up in a second. Fine, you just keep doing what you're doing. Well guys, as you can see, it's starting to clean up pretty nicely. Uh, there is a lot of white paint underneath this primer, which is probably some cheap spray on primer. I'm not gonna go crazy trying to blast it all off. I just wanna pressure wash and get off what's gonna come off on its own. I do have plans on painting this truck 
Um, don't want to tell the color just yet. We'll make that a surprise. But I'm not worried about it flaking off and being kind of a multicolor mess right now because that's cosmetic and that's later down the road. I've got Elijah inside. What? I'm helping too. That's right. He says he's helping too. He's got a pack of window cleaning wipes and he is going to town on the glass and it is dirty. But I can tell a huge difference where he's done a window and where he's not. So he's doing an awesome job. Next thing I'm going to do is continue working down on this side of the truck with the soapy mixture and the brush. And as long as this thunderstorm stays away and the rain stays away, I'll keep this camera out. Otherwise, it'll be chopped up video and I'm sorry. But it is what it is. All right, so I'm going to close the door next and continue on down the side of this truck. So there's a look at the truck and it's starting to come pretty good and clean. Now there's some spots on the hood of course that don't look that great. I'm not worried about it again. I just want to get anything off that's going to come off and kind of prep it, loosely prep it, for painting whenever I do decide to paint it in the future. The sky is about to open up on me so I'm going to try and rush and go ahead and finish the other side but I don't want to risk my camera out in the rain. And rather than bore you guys with the same stuff I think I'll go ahead and end the video here. So there's a lot of stuff to do and a lot of repairs, but I'm going to save that for the next video. I want to get this baby washed and cleaned, and then I'll do a walk around and kind of make a list of what I see needs to fix and kind of put it all in priority. Until that time, guys, I appreciate you watching. If you aren't a subscriber yet, please consider hitting that subscribe button. It doesn't cost you anything, and it just keeps you in the loop with this project and anything else that goes on on our homestead. Otherwise, I'll see you guys next time, rain or shine, on Green Acre Homestead. Take care. Guys, I think this thunderstorm is about two minutes away from really just hammering down. The tra tripod just moved. Stay it. Quit scooching around. How am I going to trust you if you keep moving? Looks levelish.